Hi. In this video, we will be creating custom bunnies brush. In the previous video, complex black and white brushes can be created by saving a grayscale image as using the GBR file extension. The content of such a brush is treated line and alpha channel. This means that any pixel that is pure white is treated as transparent. However, in this tutorial we will be creating brushes that use pictures with color and this brush will also have multiple images. Create a new image the size of the brush you will be creating. We can see the dimension from Windows Explorer info box. Expand the advanced options. Create it with a transparent background. For our example, we will be creating a 387 by 302 pixels image. For the resolution, I'm going for 96 pixels per inch. Go to the Layers panel and create additional layers by drag and drop the PNG files into GIMP. I'm going to keep the embedded color profile. I'm going for green, white, pink, blue, and yellow order. Finally, delete or clear the background layer. The last step is to export your brush as a GIMP picture brush. So, choose File Export As. The extension of this kind of brush is GIH. Expand Select File Type by extension. Choose GIMP Brush Animated. The export image as brush pipe dialog will ask you how you want to export the image. The spacing means how much space is left before the next image is drawn. 100% is the length of whole image. If the value is lower, then the image will be drawn more frequently. I set this value to 110%. Since we have 5 layers, make sure to put 5 in the ranks edit box. Remember the color order? Five also mean that the brush will get yellow thumbnail. In most cases, random will do fine, but I will choose incremental. You can experiment with others to see how they affect the brush. You can see the path at the bottom of main window where GIMP says image exported to. In my case, I have to refresh. For our example, the brush was named Bunnies. If you want the GIMP to be able to use your new brush, you have to save it in the brushes folder inside your personal GIMP folder. I've covered this in previous video so, Check that out if you unsure where to put it. To test the brush, I need to create a new file. To see our brush, go to the brushes dialog and hit the refresh button. Our bunny image should appear in the dialog. Let's test our brush. Select our brush from the brush dialog, resize the brush and start drawing. If you can't find your brush, make sure you have saved the brush in the GIMP brushes folder and that it has an extension of GIH. You will note that our bunny on the right has a little red triangle in the bottom right corner. This tells us that the brush contains multiple pictures. You can click on the brush image and hold the mouse button to see a preview of the brush. The brush animation will show you that it contains the five images. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos.